Informal Reading Inventory by Michael Grant. Background Information I perform an informal reading inventory on Shanice. She's a nine-year-old. She'll start fourth grade in the fall. She's the oldest of three girls. She's very enthusiastic and full of energy. She has excellent comprehension skills, but is easily distracted and frustrated during reading. The first thing I did was to develop a rapport. I made sure that she was comfortable in a comfortable setting. It was in the back of the classroom at the round table in the library area. Shanice told me some um, information about her and some of her interests. She enjoys playing video games, making beaded bracelets, and reading Junie B. Jones storybooks, chapter books. Administering the WRI, I started with level 2.1 because it was two levels below her grade level. She was rushing and made a few mistakes. She was overconfident and assumed that the words were too easy. She said that these words are easy and she knows them and she would make simple mistakes. She would go back and self-correct. She did not use reading strategies for words that she would not that she did not know. She would just guess. Administering the ORA, I began at the first grade level. She answered all the questions correctly. She started to omit some words. She began to get antsy and distracted as the difficulty level progressed. And she will also leave out leave off endings and change beginning sounds of words. Next we went to the listening capacity test. She had difficulty with answering main idea questions. She will omit details that supported the main idea from the text. And as the difficulty progressed, Answers were simple and less um, detailed. The results and the intervention. intervention. She, her independent reading level was 2.1, instructional level 2.1 to 3.1, frustrational 3.1, and listening comp comprehension levels 4.1. I recommend small group instruction to reinforce phonics skills and also using graphic organizers to help organize story details and thoughts. She can also um, use flashcards to uh, work on endings and beginning sounds.